Is my application modular is visible, ma? No, ma. Your studio is visible for me. Not this one. Hmm? Yeah, Brahmin, that. Um. Can you do it again? Yes, ma'am. Create one more new process with Facebook name. You close that one and explain the procedure to us. Can you do it, ma'am? Yes, ma'am. Okay, good. My students, see, he is explaining. All of you should watch this. Ma'am, screen is visible, ma'am. Yes, ma'am, visible. No. We have to maximize your screen, ma'am. Zoom it out, ma'am. I think it's maximum. Okay, do it again. Take one more application. Default create object. Explain like that. Facebook. Next. Facebook. Next. Open the Facebook uh, object studio. And application modular, go to application modular, next. And here we have to choose uh, based on our uh, search engine, ma'am. Chrome, Firefox, uh, Edge, or Internet Explorer, sir. Mm. I choose Internet Explorer, next. Browse the launch from the executable file, next. Next. It is default, right? Mm. Yes, ma'am. Here we must. Test the path of the Facebook. Mm. And paste the path of the Facebook account. Next. And we have to remove the sticks. Now. In the video, they didn't show any tick mark there. What Next. Now? Can you go back it? For uh, here, a pop up box, there would be some ticks for two, uh, two things, ma'am. Hmm. But in the video, they didn't show any tick marks there. Mm -hmm. You have to remove the tick marks. Excellent. Uh, next, next. Finish. And here element one, user. Mm. Username. Maximize this, ma. Maximize this window. Username. Launch. At the bottom there is a launch. Mm -hmm. And now identify. Spy element. Wait a second. After launch, what you got? After launch, I have got this screen. This mm. screen, man. Mm. Identify. I have I have clicked on identify. Mm. And it will uh, directly show the Facebook uh, path we had given, no, ma'am. Spy. Are you spied it after identify? Yes, ma'am. Identify spy. Then it will. Uh, Show the page where we have given the path of the uh, Facebook, ma'am. It will direct it to Facebook, right? Yes, ma'am. Then control and left click. Mm. Here we would get uh, these uh, elements, ma'am, attributes. By clicking control and left click, right? Then only yes, we get it. Mm. Then okay. Mm. Again, we would go to 
applications application modular and we would here we would add element ma'am here password password identify spy element and again uh, we would go there right click control and uh, left click ma'am mm. then we would get these uh, attributes again mm. highlight mm. and okay every time you need to highlight after spying that right yes ma'am okay and again application modular mm. element here now login ma'am mm. what is the element type for login are you choosing anything no right mm. at login we had again uh, identify and spy the element okay. there uh, they will come it will come there by default yes ma'am mm, okay identify spy element mm. then we would direct it to login and there also control and right click mm. a left click control and left click so then what you got to... in uh, type click type what you got defaultly data type na ma'am mm -hmm. yeah not that text in... click type click click type check type check type means before the data type you have one box right before element data... type ma'am ah uh, element type window window yes ma'am okay 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 then do it and highlight mm. click on okay mm. now we will go to action one page ma'am mm. in action one we would have to take to navigations mm. navigation one navigation two mm. and uh, right page mm. one right page two data types mm. data one data two mm. data one uh, is username ma'am mm. name mm. it would be text format okay oh. and data type 2 oh. password mm. and it would be password type mm. data type would be password and we have to give a password okay and now get here we would view facebook one is there no ma'am mm. that one we have to drag here facebook one and action mm. action is launch mm. and directly it will come yes mm. then okay mm. right mm. and we will go to right page mm. and here we would view first username mm. from the left side we would view username in the value place ma'am yes in the element we will give from uh, right side uh, right side mm. and we would add uh, another one mm. it would password. be password mm. and now he, from the right side we will take a password again mm. okay mm. navigate to login action type clear window center what more click click window center hmm yes okay and we would take uh, this wait page wait ma'am two weights mm -hmm. wait one wait two and here wait one we would limit the time limit in for for 7 mm. okay and here also for 7 you are given value as yes, ma'am 
at the bottom time out is there no ma'am mm. actually they have shown for 7 seconds but we may keep for 4 seconds also it's mm. our wish mm. okay and we have to link the stages from navigate to wait wait to time out and right one right arrow and from navigate to navigate to to wait to mm. and time out to end mm. refresh it is there any errors no problem keep there <laughs> and refreshing ma'am there are zero errors yes. and we have to rim close the all tabs which are at the background yes yes all chrome tabs you just close it chrome tabs are i have closed. i had used uh, windows explorer ma'am windows explorer only used no huh? yes ma'am hmm. so i have to close all the explorer tabs Mm -hmm. And now refresh and launch. It has opened, ma'am, for me. Mm -hmm. Wait a second. Yes, ma'am. Is it taken ID password? Uh, it has opened directly, ma'am, without any password and uh, those. Mm -hmm. Immediately it had opened. Mm -hmm. That is the provision in the Internet Explorer, I think so. For Chrome, it yes. shows. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Which uh, video you watched? My second. Uh, just now I shared. Second video, ma'am. 